Hey, um, this one is a very fast tutorial that I'm going to do because it's something that I ran into and I quickly came up with, so I thought maybe somebody out there will have this very same specific issue that they want to do. Say you're playing a game on your Super Nintendo emulator on your computer, and then you get the emulator on your phone, only to find out that you don't have the save files that you had when you were playing on your computer. Sometimes this can be annoying, and for many of us, we don't want to restart our games. So, what do you do? Um, you transfer the files. It's actually pretty simple as you can see here. This is on my iPhone and I do not have any save files for the game. But, there's an easy workaround. You can transfer those files over from the save games you made on your computer. All you need is your phone, uh, the emulator itself, and then USB cables. Simple enough, iPhone to USB. And then once you're on your computer, you need an application called iPhone Explorer. That's about it. I'll have a link, plug in your phone, and then you simply see it all pop up, you look for the SIOS folder, you go to documents, you see your game there but you don't see any saves, and then from there, just look for the save file on your computer, which is an SRM file, and then easily drag and drop it over. That's about it. And then you can exit out of your iPhone Explorer, load up your phone again, as you can see me doing here, and then as you can see, I do have an internal memory now. And that basically means that you've got your save file and it's working fine. While it's loading up, you can see that it's all working fine, there's no corruptions, and that's all good to know. And then right here, the moment of truth, now I've got my save files on there. How easy was that? So, hopefully this helped out the two people that might have been looking for this, and I suspect this may work with other emulators as well. So, give it a try, explore a little bit, maybe you'll find something new. Um, as for installing the emulators, I'm not going to go into that. There are millions of those around. But if you have any other questions, leave them in the comments. I normally take a look. But, um, hopefully you guys got something cool from this. Anyways, enjoy.